Chinese officials say the death toll from a collapsed highway in southeastern Guangdong province rose to 48, some 24 hours after a section of the four-lane mountainous pass buckled in the wake of record rainfall and flooding, sending 23 vehicles tumbling down a steep slope with some bursting into flames. Point three people remained unidentified, pending DNA testing, according to a local official in Meizhou City. It was not immediately clear if they died, which would bring the death toll to 51. At least 30 other people had non-life-threatening injuries, the Ministry of Emergency Management has dispatched a team to the scene to guide rescue work, and has urged local efforts to accelerate search and rescue work, treat those who sustained injuries, minimize casualties, and determine the cause of the accident. The collapse occurred on one side of a four-lane highway in Meizhou, just as China kicked off a five-day holiday. For a second day, rescuers searched for trapped people by digging through mountainous terrain. Construction cranes lifted out burnt out and mangled vehicles, the National Financial Regulatory Administration has guided insurance institutions to establish a special working group for the emergency handling of such events, integrating insurance resources in open green channels, heavy rains, the risk of secondary disasters and the large number of trapped, burned and buried vehicles were complicating rescue efforts, a city official said. More than 570 people and 80 rescue vehicles have been deployed to help with the mission. Meizhou is one of the areas in southern China's Guangdong that has been overwhelmed by heavy rain since last month. The adverse weather triggered dangerous mudslides, inundated homes, and destroyed bridges.